Hello, everybody. Ooh, game audio. Come back. Come back, game audio. There we go. Very faint. Hi, everybody. Happy Sunday. I'm excited to finish this swan. That's how I feel right now. Pretty stoked to finish this swan. Uh, every estimate on how long this game is supposed to take said two to three hours. We've already played it two hours, and I seem to remember us being halfway through the chapters. It always takes longer to play things on stream. Uh, because of all the, the goofs and japes and uh, hullabaloos and shenanigans I pull. Uh, so I think, I, think, I think getting through the second half will also take two hours. If not, here's my pitch. We'll do a Steam library roulette or a game library roulette where I'll, I'll open Steam and Epic Games. Uh, and we'll roll a number and whatever number is the game is the game that we'll finish off the stream on i don't know that might be cool or boring or terrible so we'll see uh mostly i'm just excited to get in here and finish this ding dang swan how can it eat like this it can't it's got no esophagus and swans are like mostly esophagus so that feels like it's really leaving this poor poor swan out 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 of uh function but okay hello everybody <laughs> uh thank you ace jackal and lizzie who for uh, re-upping your subscriptions swan any percent speed run well here's the problem is if we were doing that uh we'd i think it would already be done <laughs> uh because this is like 90 percent swan and we're there we did that I started, I clicked on continue to get the game loaded up earlier and it launched right into sailed out this. In darkness following the swan's voice, but he never saw a thing. Not the stars, not the swan, and certainly not the tree he got stuck in. When the clouds lifted, the swan was gone, leaving Monroe alone in the middle of an immense forest. Since there was nothing else to be done, he jumped. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's right. We're at the... Oh, gosh, it's spooky. I hope I have white paint. Uh, let me know how the... Actually, let me... Yeah, no, let me know how the game audio is for y'all. Uh, so I think we're on... If I remember the last time we were at the castle and we looked through uh, a... Um, we looked through uh, like an eyeglass and we saw this giant uh, uh, statue, I guess, building. And uh, it had no heart. Oh, hello. Okay. It's very unnerving just to be in an all black setting. Oh, whatever game. The game trapped me. Quiet. Uh, the game, the game audio is quiet. Let me. I'll increase it a little bit. It's mostly just ambient sound right now. Oh! Well, I didn't like that one bit. Hi, bird. Okay. Ooh, hi. Oh, I see a spider web. <laughs> Am I gonna fall into another pit game? I, I didn't realize we were playing the survival horror level. But we do seem to be. Oh, oh. Okay, cool. Did that help me much? A little bit. Oh, ho, 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 ho. if I finish the spot and it has spider legs, I like the implication. Yeah, I we've been assuming that the neck is the part of the swan that we need to finish but there's no there's no claiming like what other parts of this spawn are unfinished i've been assuming it's a normal swan whose sweet little neck needs to get completed but that does not mean that that's what it is ah oh, patient overshirt sure. thank you for re-upping your subscription it i am also shocked it's been eight months i just i i I do love these little punching bag eggplants. I like the design of this little light, and I would like one of these for my house. I would like one of these as a sconce. Uh, I spent yesterday re 
con configuring, reconnoitering uh, the the intro video for um, uh, my Blender art streams, so that they now are up to date, so we can we can revisit all of our old friends. So I'm excited about that. But going through that, I was like, oh wow, it has it has been like eight or nine months that I've been doing this, which is pretty wild. Oh, I don't like that sound. And I don't like those eerie, eerie statue eyes in the background. Oh, AJ. Thank you for the gift sub to Nicholas. I guess I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, I- oh, hi, spider. Oh, hi, spiders! There's two of you. Are you gonna run if I boop this? Or are you gonna- Ooh! Ooh, boy. Well. Oh! I see some footsteps. But I also- I see one of these over there, but I, my guess is I can't get there yet. Oh. Hmm. Night coffee, what I like about your question is that a patient overshirt really is quite different from patient overshirt. Like the patient named overshirt. Ooh. The music just got a little bit more action-y? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I got attacked! This game has health now? <laughs> I was not expecting this game to ever have health mechanics. Uh, I haven't- AJ, I haven't seen any balloons this level yet. I have to assume they're somewhere though. I was really genuinely not expecting this game to have a health mechanic. Can I just not? I don't like that. I guess I'll just run for it. Ow! Uh... Don't, uh... Painting you guys black, I feel like, is not actually going to help me quite at all. Ah! Okay. Okay, I guess I can push this around. Hello! That's a balloon. I wonder if I can't... I, I guess I can't get to that house that we saw. Nope, up the tube. Up the pipe. Not get you up the pipe? Is that not what we're supposed to be doing? Here we go. I can hear those little spiders chittering, which is not a thing I think spiders do. Ooh, a shooting star! Everybody make a wish! I wish uh, I didn't get attacked by any more spiders this level. Oh, we've received another puppy emote. Hold on. We are just playing, yeah, we're playing Super Monkey Ball. This is the the Super Monkey Ball. Ah, I was in the darkness for too long. <laughs> I like this puppy emote. I like all the puppy emotes. 
I don't know, it doesn't work on Linux? That's a shame. Into the hole. Hole in one. Ah, paprika. I love paprika. Ooh. Cool little pond. No, don't, don't roll too quickly. Don't roll too quickly, I need you. Okay, part two, the river. Oh, do I just have to follow close to you? Okay. I'm gonna boop you. Boop! Genuinely did not expect a, a spooky spider level. Oh gosh, the light. Did not expect a spooky level in this painting children's game. Oh, World of Horror is so good. I don't think it's possible to be good at World of Horror. I, I don't know if there's... Hi, Frogo. Oh, no. No! No! Slow down! Don't go down! Oh, no! Oh, I died? I can die in this game? Oh. World of Horror is a very good indie horror game that's based on uh, largely the work of Junji Ito. Oh, okay, I did die again. No, stop doing this to me. No! <laughs> uh, uh, m largely based on Junji Ito, but also based on a lot of other... Oh, come on. Oh. Wait, tell us your hot tip on how to do good at... Come on, come on, come on. World of Horror. There we go. Okay, the last time I died, I saw a spooky eyeball as I fell. But I don't see what that spooky eyeball could have belonged to, which is also spooky. Add here. Oh yeah, I don't think I've ever read... Junji Ito did the art for a Frankenstein adaptation that I have not, I don't think, ever watched or ever read. T. The king was tired of creating perfect kingdoms only to attract less than perfect subjects. He decided he'd have to leave a legacy the old-fashioned way, with a family. So he began to build one, starting with a house. Okay. Wait, does that mean he's gonna have... With a family. Alright, so this is gonna be my, my birth story? Kind of weird energy. Come on, you gotta come with me. I'm not, I'm not about getting it. this boba going to waste. Can I interact with the fungus? That's a good question. If I see more fungus, I'll shoot at it. Seems to be mostly what I can interact. No, 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 no. Don't go so quickly. Don't go so quickly. Oh, interesting. much luck with people so instead of trying to find a wife he painted one he when did. she opened her eyes the king was astonished he had created a female version <laughs> of himself the king was in love okay dude okay dude <laughs> like pygmalion but like somehow even a level worse than that like pygmalion if the uh 
sculptor had just sculpted himself. Can I, can I get you? Ugh. Oh god, I don't like that. Oh, it's just dark. I don't like for a moment. It's just dark, and that's all that it is. But I don't. S I don't see any more spiders. Is there anything over there? Kind of in a trans mood. Okay, yeah. I guess I can see that. Let me. Is there anything over here? Just darkness. Right. I don't think I can get that balloon yet. Do I? Do I go in here? <laughs> can I go in here? Yeah. Oh, now I'm worried. I was supposed to explore more. Hold on. Can I get this loofed balloon? There's a whole a whole area it looked like over here. Um, maybe I have to unlock that later. Ah, oh, Ace Jackal converted a prime gaming sub to a tier one sub. I don't necessarily know what that means, but the fact that Twitch is alerting me to it makes me feel like it's something good. So thank you, I guess. <laughs> is this gonna fall out from underneath me? No? Okay. Didn't that doesn't this have like trapdoor feel? Like it's gonna cut cut through? Uh hmm. That looks like it will kill me if I fall off. <laughs> jackals are cool and ace jackals would be the coolest one. Yeah, I think ace jackals is like ace pilot, right? Well, game. Oh, interesting. Wait, why? What is number? Scoozy? Scoozy? Well, am I too late to get you? Okay. Okay, suddenly I'm in Illustrator. Okay, so... making little bar graphs to get where I need to go. This is a, I'm, I'm, I'm digging this. And so I assume I'm supposed to make steps here. Okay. Interesting. I guess I can only make it on the blue. For some reason, this is giving me portal vibes. I think prob probably the uh, fact that I cannot do it <laughs> on certain of these levels is what's giving me portal vibes. Oh, Ace Jackal, thank you for the gift sub to Captain Oblivion. Is this going to fill in exactly where the lines go? Ah! Thank you. 
No? Okay, I did it wrong. Can I, can I redo it? <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I did a bad job. Wait, do I have the thing? How do I access the toys again? That's not what I wanted. Did I not have one that would erase it? Hey, Chad. Toys. Oh, I can buy them in here. Is there something I can buy that'll erase? Oh, okay, I did buy it. Hold on. Oh, for real, game? <laughs> it cleared off everything but the thing I needed it to clear off? <laughs> I... <laughs> I guess I just... Okay. I undid it somehow. I do not know what I did to undo it, but I am glad. I'm not going to do this by the book, though, and this game can't make me. Okay, maybe this game can make me. Yeah, the puppy hype emotes are very good. Ooh! All right. Goodbye, weird clean world. I'm back here. I made a big old loop. Okay. Oh, and the staircase I made is persistent, which is great because it's a great staircase. Very avant-garde. Pretty classy. I do love the sound that these orbs make. Alright, let's see what this does. Bursting with joy, the king locked himself in his workshop painting gifts for his queen. He never saw her lack of interest, though she made no effort to hide it. Ah. The only gift she kept was his first, a little silver paintbrush. <laughs> I'm so amused at this disinterested queen. She made no effort to hide it. I didn't see her lack of interest. A nice big water balloon. Yeah, that's kind of the sound. A real plump, real plump water balloon. How come I... Am I making a roof? Can I hit you? Oh, uh, Vaporize, thank you for upping your subscription. Get that eight month streak, hell yeah. Well, I guess I'm just gonna, oh. Oh. Uh. Oh. Uh. Hmm. Huh. Oh. Uh. Huh. Okay, so I can't, maybe there's stairs over here, hold on. Looks like there's a ramp. Get to you? Yeah, okay. Ah, this hippo. This hippo is sending me. I love this hippo. Boom. Oh, you're not gonna. Okay. Uh, ooh. Part four the nursery. Uh, is he gonna draw just himself as a baby? Every day, the king painted a new room for the house, and every day he abandoned it as not good enough for his queen. While he slept, the queen spent her nights painting creatures of the forest, hmm. though she never finished a single one. Five months went by before the king noticed she was pregnant. This is <laughs> not a great couple, is how I feel about these two. I do love this frog, though. Really like the design of this frog. Uh, all right, let me, I'm gonna peek out this window. It's pretty. Okay. Uh, just dive in. Whee! Ah! Okay. Yeah, <laughs> the, 
the um, Christopher Lee emote is my favorite emote. Ooh. Oh, that's just I infinity. Okay. I was like, is that just a weird carpet? No, that's just affinity. Okay. Boop. Oh, interesting. So as long as the one is in view. Well, let's start. Let's start simple. Still, I have a flonk fruit. That's amazing. If you need reference images, let me know. Okay, let's go ahead and close this off. I don't think we'll need the full roof, but uh, it's better to have a full roof and not need it than to need a full roof and not have it. There you go. Oh, look at this horse. Can I ride you? No, you don't move. Okay, that's fine. standing? Uh, I guess not. Boop. Oh. <laughs> uh, interesting. Okay. Corn gazebo, yeah. <laughs> uh, this is awful neat. I'm I'm awfully pleased with this as a mechanic. It kind of kind of reminds me of uh the ice block power in Zelda. All these empty picture frames. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. I see some feet. And I want to step where those feet are. Stand in the place where those feet are. how open this is because it's it's clear that there's a lot of ways of completing this puzzle in particular you just kind of give it a blank canvas and you gotta figure it out i like that it's because the swan is carrying you <laughs> all right swan oh god for a moment i was like oh there's just no floor there is Boop. Uh, 
need to get up there, but there's no blue paint in here. And there are some feet over here. And over here, oop! That staircase just ends. That's not ideal. Generally speaking, that's not what staircases should do, IMO. Controversial opinion. Staircases should go on. Not at all OSHA compliant. In fact, so OSHA uncompliant, it looks like something I would have drawn in, in mocking OSHA. Well, that just goes nowhere. I guess I'm supposed to... Uh, okay. I wasn't certain a run and jump maneuver was going to function. Feels like there should be a balloon nearby, but I don't see one. Ooh. What? Hey. hey, it's Journey. We can see Journey from here. We can see the game Journey. Okay, cool. Do I see... Is that like a tongue on the king? There's a little red blep on the king statue. And I can't tell if it's supposed to be a balloon or just like a... Okay. Well, what am I supposed to do about that game? My top three Pokemons? God, that's a great question. I love Pumpkaboo. Uh, and I love Bulbasaur. So those are top two, for sure. Uh, ooh, top three is trickier. Uh, I'm trying to think what the third is. Snorlax might be... I do quite love Snorlax. Uh, oh, hi. Bulbasaur was my first starter, uh, and so, and, and as such, will always be <laughs> my favorite. Is They're just so cute. I mean, it, yeah, picking a third is so difficult. I love Oddish. Oddish. Uh, um, I love Ponyta. Uh, this is gonna really work my brain jumping into this. Woo! Okay. Hmm. One of the things I like most about both Bulbasaur and Oddish is uh, how fan artists depict them as like other vegetables as somebody who loves vegetables that really appeals to me Oop. Oof. i can see the dude we're getting closer to the dude am i just supposed to wander off into the dark woods here okay I also love Halloween Pumpkin Bulbasaur. Just so cute. On the night before the queen was to give birth, she left. Dang, All girl. All she took was a single unfinished painting. When the king woke, he found no explanation, and he never did. Dang. Dang. Gosh, a lot of shooting and falling stars. Okay, let me just... Spooky sounds. Okay. I guess I'm supposed to get in you and hit you? Oh! I do not have control over this boat. <laughs> Ooh. I jumped immediately into the water. <laughs> For nine years, the king didn't paint a thing. Then, he had a vision. A colossal monument of himself that would be his legacy for the ages. But he hadn't even finished painting the scale model, which was over 100 feet tall itself, when his powers 
began to fail. Oh, goodness. A, a scale model. The word scale is uh, perplexing in this instance. I guess it's scale to the actual mod, the actual statue. I guess, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. I worked out. I figured it out, gang. <laughs> Ooh, I see electricity. My guess is that's gonna kill me at least once during this segment. The king never finished another painting. <clears throat> then one night he went to sleep and couldn't even finish his own dream. Oof. And he's been trapped inside it ever since. Look <laughs> at this hippo. <laughs> I love this hippo. I love the energy of this hippo. It's really good work. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, the actual scale would be two feet tall. Needs to make it 50 times scale to make sure the details are plotted. That tracks. Okay. So that looks like what I'm supposed to climb, but it also looks like it would hurt me. Uh, I don't know how paint is going to solve this. Oh, but I see some oh electricity making me nervous. Himpo <laughs> Okay. Am I just supposed to like black you out? Ah it's a lemon! Ah! Uh oh. Ah I didn't think hitting the lemon would do such a thing. Oh god, the lemon's gone. Well, well, that lemon's gone. I guess it's fine. Oh, I'm in water, okay. Okay, let's look at this a little bit, okay. So clearly I'm supposed to boop the lemon. Maybe if I jump? Oh god, it's flooding! There's water! <laughs> okay, I was wondering where the water came from. Oh, it flood. And there's the lemon! There the lemon goes. And there's a whole, whole lemon tree. Oh my god, the water's still rising! <laughs> oh no! Um, ah, creep. Ah, criminy crickets. But I can't see anything. I hate water rising levels. They stress me out. Oh god. It's, I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go, game. Game, don't auto load me here. I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go. Game! Oh, I see. That's not where I was supposed to get off. Ooh. Yeah, this uh, the second half of this game has been a much different ride than the first half. The first half was a chill art game. And this portion has been a lot of spiders and lemons and stuff. I hear a swan. I hear a honkus. I hear a swan honkus. Swan, you're supposed you've gotta save me, buddy. You can fly. Swan, you can fly, you gotta get me out of here. Oh no, come on. Oh god, am I I think I'm on the dude. Yeah, Swan! Don't you leave! Don't you leave! Damn it, Swan! I don't know if a funicula is going to save us from drowning. 
But the water, maybe the water has stopped. Ooh. Uh, right up into the nostril. Oh. Spiders and lemons in the mouth of St. Clements. <laughs> As Monroe stood there trying to think of something to say, the statue shuddered and the hatch slammed shut. And now there was no more need for talking. Mm -mm. The king was awake. Time for the boss battle. All right. <laughs> Oh, I see. Okay, we're on. How do we do? Oh, wow. Not not a single one in the King's Monument. Well, that's fine. All right, not, not so bad. Okay. I'm curious what the credit sequence is going to be. Let's hop into this dream. On the way up? Okay. Well, I never would have... Could never stop. Too much panic to stop and get the extras during a water rising auto run level. Ah, it's ah. you, the boy from my dream. Ha -ha. What a strange dream it was. My life's work was being destroyed and Ooh. all I could do was watch. Come, <gasps> sit here by the fire. <laughs> it all began right there in the house I grew up in. The hippo voice is genuinely very startling. Heavy knocking at the door, just like on the night I left. Ah! It me! Oh, God, okay, wow. The fact that it does not really change in size as you get closer it's somehow very upsetting this is the most this is the best horror game thing i've seen maybe all year this is terrifying this is terrifying and i hate it <laughs> okay oh god he's still there he's looking at me oh god oh god bye patient over sir i opened the door but there was nothing there just White space. Oh, this is pretty cool. Am I supposed to keep going? Oh god. Just gonna back away from the door. Oh. <sighs> I, I wore my little dude out by walking too much, I guess. Okay, well, now I live here. I live here now. This is the rest of the game. I'm in the white space. Oh, I don't know if I've ever seen what Edward Gorey looks like. Oh, oh. Okay. I can tell I'm still walking when I hear footsteps. But when <gasps> I got outside, <laughs> disaster. Oops. Some miscreant uh -oh. had painted everything. Oops. My garden was ruined. Uh-oh. That could have been anyone with a paint gun. You've, that could have been... There's no proof. That could have been anyone. This could have been anyone. And then my statue spoke and said, Help me! Some little hooligan is running around splattering everything in the garden. I think he's headed for the... <laughs> <laughs> Something got it by mouth. <gasps> oh, dear. oh, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Okay. This one, that ain't me. That ain't me, Holmes. I didn't I do that. An unfinished labyrinth, abandoned and forgotten. Hey, and this is credits on appeared. Oh. Your dreams have credits? <laughs> oh, yes, and subtitles. <laughs> Oh wait, can I clean off that king? The answer is no, but I can hit this balloon.
I wonder if you could train your brain to subtitle your dreams. I don't know what would go into that. That might be an interesting experiment. Written by Ian Douglas. Dallas. See, I, I guess I'm confused because I thought we had a whole other chat. Like, there was a credits when we were looking at the chapter headers. There was one of them that was credits, but I did not think that was this section. Oh, right. I don't know if I feel like I have learned what happened to Monroe, the Finch, Monroe Finch, who this is. Ish. Can I... Am I supposed to climb you? Am I just supposed to drop down? Oh, vaporize, that's a good point. Beautiful city, oh. strangled by those disgusting vines. I built it to stand a hundred lifetimes, and instead, it'll be buried in one a monument for weeds. Swan, come back. You can't smell in dreams. Uh, God, even thinking about that is blowing my mind. Because, like, he, yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Because you don't, your nose is asleep. Because your nose isn't there in the dream. Yeah, the memory of a smell. That makes sense. I cannot remember ever even thinking I was smelling something in a dream. No, oh no, let me in. The dining hall was full of people, like the old days. It smelled like roasted goose. For a moment, I was happy. Once again, really alarming. alone again. The world had become cold and dark. And full of sp 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 spiders. I felt oh. my own death rising up around oh God. me. Am I supposed to climb? Can I climb you? Uh... 
I don't see a fireplace to climb. So I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do. Can I... Can I not grab onto you? Can I not knock you down? Am I just supposed to jump? Okay, I was just supposed to jump across the water that just killed me. Oh god, it's rising. Swan animation, thank you. What? Press F to pick up box? Oh my god. What a dramatic time to introduce a new mechanic. It's the credits. Julie Perry. Excellent narration. I have floated past chunks of the house I built or was started building. Scarcely ten years later, and the whole thing was in ruins. My works were meant to last oh, forever, Terry Gilliam. but most of them will be gone before I am. Oh God, what just I was happened? At a funeral. My own, as it turned out. No one was there. Except you. Yeah, I did not even recognize this was Terry Gilliam, but that rules. Oh, did Ter did something happen with Terry Gilliam? I vaguely remember hearing something. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, we're us again. We're us again, and it's terrifying. <laughs> oh, rip. Rip. Rip, my dude. Oh god, I can't even cover my own horrible face. Whoop! Okay. Yeah, swan big. Swan big make me nervous. Okay, so I can't go that way. Am I just supposed to crawl over this dude's dead body? Game? Okay, I saw game. my monument. My last hope of leaving something that would live on after me. And I began to walk towards it. And with each step I took, Dope. I got larger. Yeah. I just Big. growing and growing like a teenager. <laughs> With a gentle push, my money crumbled and sank. Big. I saw my life's work laid out in front of me. Soon it would crumble into dust or be painted over by someone who would come after me the same way I painted over what was here before me. Bum bum bum. Crush it. Crush the labyrinth under your big, meaty feet. When the universe ended, I knew that everything I'd made was over. And as I sat there, looking out into the darkness, I thought back on all the things I'd built and left unfinished. I realized something. I wasn't sad that it was all gone. I had fun making all that stuff. I would have done it anyway. And then, somehow I knew that when I woke up, all my work really would be destroyed. And that's when you showed up. <laughs> I don't know how you got here, but I'm glad to see you. I have something for you. This brush isn't mine anymore. My work is over. It belongs to you now. I hope it makes you happy and that someday they will say, he is a better man than his father. Is that swan that taking off with my will brush? Take you anywhere you want to go, but leave quickly, child. None of this will last for long. And that night, even though he was very tired, Monroe did something that would have made his mother very happy. <gasps> he painted. Oh, a swan with two little baby swans. Oh. Yeah, this is the prequel to the Untitled Goose Game. Did we, is that, did we finish the swan though? 
Did we game? Did we finish the swan? Okay, so I think that was everything, but I want to double check. Okay, so with that is the extras a different section? Oh. What? Oh, I think this is just the credits. The actual credits, not the in-game credits? I mean, I really liked the in-game credits. Uh, I don't know if I thought we needed another extra credit scene, but here it is that we are getting, I guess. I love this art style. It's very good, love the line. It looks like, um, they look like stick and poke tattoos almost. Yeah. It's dope. Oh yeah, can I fire in the credits? I don't seem to be able to interact. What? Oops. I accidentally backed out of the credits, but I wasn't able to do anything else. Um, gosh, okay. I was not expecting to... I was I kind of expected it to take the full two hours that I normally stream, but that's not the case. Let me buy some of these XDs. Pick up blueprint boxes, I see. I can do that now. Unlock chapters, I can buy the sniper rifle, finally. After all balloons are found, I see. That unlock the last chapters? <laughs> this, I, I think, I, I think Patient Overture said something like this before they left, but a very strong Le Petit Prince energy from this whole thing. Especially the very end shots where we saw like the whole, the whole planet. Like this feels like it is a planet, one of the planets in Le Petit Prince. It's so nice though. It's so delicate. I like the, the sketchiness of it. Love this hippo. What is the deal with the hippo? Why did the hippo talk? Hippo hippo citric sequel to Unfinished Swan, please. Sorry, I'm lowering the volume a little bit. Okay. Journey to Little Prince, yeah. Yes, that too. Wall ground. Hee <laughs> hee, orbs. I love this little eggplant flower. That rules. Phew. Oh, the pitcher plant version. It's also very good. The hippo! Oh, hippo. Oh, crocodilio. Oh, cool street lamps. Ha! Ah! Fashion queen. This is cool. This is a great. I love this. <laughs> ah, swan. Delightful. Okay. Yeah, that crocodilio had to have been that one green eye. And one ominous green eye. Uh, okay, well, I guess I'm going to quit this game. And then let me open up Epic and Steam. And we'll just, I guess we'll just roll the dice and see what I have installed and that'll, that'll be what we play. Open up the libraries. Uh, I guess, let me pick a, like a number generator and I'll just count starting with Epic going through 
uh, Steam. Ooh, let me click this Edward Gorey link. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, that's a good look. All right, maximum. Let's do maximum 25 number. All right, give me number 13. Very spooky. Uh, all right, let me count through. I'm not going to start with the unfinished one. I'm not going to include that in my count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, God. Okay. Well, fuck. Shit. Okay. So what I've landed on, I don't have Stardew Valley installed right now. What I've landed on is Dark Souls 3, <laughs> um, which I started playing at the beginning of quarantine because I was like well I'll be locked in and that's what a great time to work on Dark Souls um but that was not <laughs> true it wasn't true it was the worst time to do Dark Souls because you need a, you need a lot of emotional resilience to do Dark Souls and that as it turns out was in short supply during a global pandemic so uh, if you guys are cool with Dark Souls 3, um, we can see how very not at all deep into the game I got. <laughs> uh, Princess Undercut. The ending of the game was a little abrupt, but mostly very good. Uh, and now we're, we're on to Dark Souls, I guess. Shit. Okay, well. I also seem to remember, I think I was playing with a controller because I played Bloodborne and Dark Souls 1 with controllers. Uh, I don't have my controller plugged in right now. And I don't, ooh, okay, here we go. Let me, let me um, get this into shape. I'll try it with mouse and keyboard, but my guess is it's gonna be, no, maybe I should just get my controller. Let me just get my controller. And please don't log me on Dark Souls 3. I do not. I just don't want to play online. All right, let me adjust the screen so that I can see chat. And let me get the game on the screen so you guys can see it. It big, okay. All right, let me grab my controller and see if I can plug it in after the fact, after opening it. Sometimes you have to not have the game open. Um, let me go grab that, hold on. Okay. Okay, is this gonna... Uh, let me shut the game down and reopen it and see if it'll connect fully. And while that's reloading, I can update the stream because boy, do I not want people hopping in here thinking they're gonna see Elfish Swan. That's updated from software. Press any button. There we go. All right. Okay. So this is Dark Souls 3. Um, let me, I don't know. Should I explain? Do you guys know? I feel like there's some people who entirely missed it. I entirely missed Dark Souls because it sounded and looked like it was going to be very difficult. And it is. And it was. Uh, so I didn't, didn't play these games for a really long time. And then my partner... Uh, loves Dark Souls, loves the whole franchise, and uh, <laughs> great, uh, great. Did I just not have clothes? It was this a choice, and what choice was it? Uh, 
I'm trying to remember, gosh, anything about my character or how to play this game. Okay, that's attack. This is block. That's big attack. That's knockback. Oh, switching out. Okay, there's roll. That's really... The rolling is really the only thing I need. Oh, God. I also... Okay. Bye. Oh, wait. Who's leaving? Oh, bye, AJ. Have a good rest of your week, too. Okay. Hey. What was I... What was I doing in this game? Okay, bye, Ace. <laughs> Okay. Uh. How do I even get out of here? I see. I. Uh, wait, can I? Is this one where I can? I think I can just fast travel. No, don't jump away from the bonfire. Rest at the bonfire. Did you, Nicholas, did you prefer with or without shield? No, I think undead settlement. Oh. I'm remembering now what happened. I think my partner and I started to play together. And because my partner is a super expert in Dark Souls, they leapt ahead in the story. Uh, so quickly that I could not keep up. That's what happened. Okay. So we were over here, but I just legitimately... Uh-oh. Please don't notice me. I'm not here. Uh oh, boy. Can I... Are we chill? Are you going to attack me? I'm going to attack you first. Haha! -ha. Get dunked on. Dope. All right. Oh, I got some gloves. Uh, my partner always plays a very dodge-heavy game, which is probably why we're not wearing any armor. <laughs> it's probably get to to get to an acceptable amount of dodge. You gotta, you gotta be slim to do the stunts in this game. You gotta be, you can't be overbearing. You are right. Who let the dogs out? It was that dude, and I killed him for it. Oh, hello. Oh, I don't like the looks of you. Hi. Whoa. Hey, dude. Wow, the designs of this game are truly great in that they are truly grotesque and upsetting. Are you going to get up and attack me? Is your head a branch? Uh, uh, my dude. Hey, what happened to you? Where, maybe you were never a dude. Maybe you were always a tree. That's the what I'm going to accept as what happened here. I can hear footsteps. You can hear footsteps, which is pretty upsetting. <gasps> no. Okay. Looks like a lot of dudes over there. Oh, God. Ugh, fall damage. Wow, there's a lot of dudes here. Am I going to have to fight all these dudes? I don't like that. Uh, it does not look like there's really anywhere for me to go, though. So... Hey, I'll just go over here. The, the harrowing of the game. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That was so startling. I liked when that one dude just flop, belly flopped on the ground when he tried to attack me. Boy, these, the design of these dudes is pretty uncomfortable. Are you gonna get up? 
doesn't this this dude looks like um when you're watching an animated show and there's one book that's colored differently from the rest of the books and you're like oh that's the one the character is going to pick up isn't that what this dude looks like are you going to attack me i guess not is that just your deal are you just purple hmm oh it had an item on it once okay i must have gone through here Uh, here's a bridge. I can hear more horrible little footsteps. Oh, it's from you guys. Come on! Ooh, a firebomb. Once again, ah! Hey! Hey! Oh god, what's the button to drink? Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Shit. Uh, how do I use you? Okay, there we go. Okay, okay. Oh. That was exciting. We're not done here. Don't walk away from me. Okay. cool little tower. See, design-wise, I think this is not so different from Unfinished Swan, right? Because it's like, got cool little tower. Everything's a little broken down. Is that message going to say people are going to stand up and attack you as soon as you walk through here? Because it was right. Ow. No double teaming. Not here. Not in my game. Ooh. Oh, I think I just got one of their hats. Hold on. Let me... Equipment. Time for some fashion souls. Yeah! Oh, it's a little bonnet! Oh, I like that. <laughs> you should do it. You might have to sew up the hem so that it doesn't unravel. But here's the thing, I feel like you can get Henley's or equivalent shirts pretty easy. Uh, and pretty pretty inexpensively. So you can just do it, and if, it, if it, you don't like the looks of it, then that's fine. That's the nice thing about asymmetricality, though. You don't, did something drop? Okay, something's gonna drop. Um, this is essentially my first playthrough, yes. Oh, what? What did you do to me? Is that poison? Or is that bleed? Uh, yeah, functionally, this is my first playthrough. Uh, I was playing through with my partner, uh, but we had to stop because they know how to play the game, and so it would be like I would play for three minutes and then, and then die and hand the controller off, and then they would play for 20 minutes because they were good at the game, and uh, it was just not ideal. We are very excited for Elden Ring, though. A game neither of us has played, and therefore will both be bad at. Oh, these things look like they're gonna explode. Uh, and the fact that somebody just threw- oh, yeah. Oh. Hello. I must be- ow! Oh, no! Hey, what? What? What are you? You look like you're going to try and put me in that. I don't want to deal with that. Why don't you come, come over here and we'll fight where they can't hit me. Ooh, not good enough. <laughs> Ooh, he make big sound. Oh, yeah, that dude want to put me in that big old pot. I wanted to cook me up into a little stew and then eat me. I'm not here for that. If somebody tries to eat you, you, you have every right to stop that. But I'm excited about finding that item because that must mean that this is a place that I've not gotten to yet.
Oh, I see another soup boy. I see another soup boy over there waiting for me. I also see an item, though. God, that's the that's the Dark Souls way, right? Here's a thing that's gonna try to to eat your butt, but it's next to a goodie. And don't you want that goodie? Ooh, some flowers. Can I not pick these flowers? There's no flower picking mechanic in this game. What's even the point? What's even the point? Ooh, an item. I hear a sound. Ah! Classic Dark Souls. I knew. I saw the thing and I was like, something's going to attack me from behind or above. Somebody's going to wreck my day for no other reason than I, I'm stealing this item off this dead body. I can't remember if Dark Souls 3 is one of the Dark Souls that has secret walls. Behind and above, sometimes below, maybe? I remember there's a very good, one of my favorite Bloodborne traps is like there's an item. You, you walk through, there's nothing there, and then a werewolf drops from the ceiling to fuck your shit up. And it's pretty good. <laughs> it's a pretty good trap. I do need to be taught stealing is wrong. So I appreciate that Dark Souls is taking the burden of that. Okay, fairly obvious hidden walls. That's good enough for me. Ooh, something something shiny and sparkly. Something that if I drop down to get would almost certainly kill me. Oh, it looks like maybe one of the lizards? Diamond lizards? Yeah, okay. Well. Okay. Stay down there. There's this area, there was that other way with that big dude. There's a whole bunch of suit men over here. That's that soup man wasn't too difficult. I think if I take him ingredient by ingredient, oh no. What? Fuck you. No. Fuck you, that's bullshit. Did you guys see that? That sucks. Oh, bleed, huh? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, I would really like to kill you before this other dude gets here. Oh, no! <laughs> okay. That blood loss, huh? I can't believe he threw his soup pot at me. I can't believe that. That's so irresponsible. If you can't keep your paws on your soup, then you shouldn't be wielding soup. That's what I have to say. All right, now where even am I? Oh, that's right. Don't come over here. I don't want to fight you. I want to activate these boys, I think. Is this where I went last time? I don't know. So I don't think I went that direction. I think I went this other way. So let me just fight this dude, I guess. Wow, did I just startle you? <laughs> I don't know what that was. I think I just startled him. Uh, okay, there is... Ooh! There's a ghost. I want to... I want to drop down here. I mean, he did, he did do a good job of sharing his soup with me. Unfortunately, he also shared quite a lot of blunt damage, which I did not appreciate. Don't ba- 
backstab me, I backstab you. Come on. One of these days I'm going to be slightly stronger and I'll be able to kill you guys in one hit. I'm really looking forward to that. Oh. That didn't work like I was hoping. None of this is working like I was hoping. Let me just go ahead and chug a lug. Oh, cool. I got one of their things. I can, I can really start cosplaying these dudes. Ambush ahead. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Thank you, message. Well, I mean, I don't see why I shouldn't. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, uh, it's so creepy that he just, like, drops from the ceiling like that. It's weird little assassin creeps. I don't care for it. Well, let's go ahead and... Get that bleed out of the way. Hey, about, how about, what if for this run, anytime I get an item, I that's what I start using? <laughs> that feels like a really bad way of playing the game, but I don't see why I shouldn't. Look at how much thrust I have. This is really gonna, see, here's the thing. This is the, clearly the best item to fight a soup boy with. Uh, in fact, I'm just going to go ahead and drop down here. Because uh, it's like a, you know, it's like a prong. It's like, it's like a cooking implement, basically. So I think this is going to be uh, really good. Ah. Oh. See, the problem with fighting one of these dudes with their own weapon is that they have more experience with it, right? So they're, they're going to be able to duel me more effectively. Ooh, Titanite Shard. Okay, I think I'm really close. Oh god, <laughs> sorry. I picked up my mouse to allow a statement and it, uh, it, uh, it juked my camera. All right. I mean, ideally I would have some sort of long um, spoon implement because a fork implement is just generally not what one uses for eating soup. Uh, almost by, by definition, I would say. Hi. Oh, cool. A bonfire. I love bonfires. Bonfires are an essential, uh, thing for soup as well. All right. I feel really, really prepared to fight a soup boy right now. A spork, yeah, if we could get some, if there was some sort of spork enemy, that would really be ideal. Oh, I'm on the roof. I can fight these dudes now. I can fight these little flamethrowers. Huh, this is not an ideal weapon for roof combat. But it gets the job done. <laughs> uh, I bet I could drop down on that soup dude. I'll get there. I'll get there. Wait, is there a dude? Can I talk to you? Hey. Hello. Hi. What's your deal? Yeah. I am Cornus, an old pyromancer. A crow's cage, as you see now. But here we are. An encounter for the ages. <laughs> I hear the unkindled make for fine vessels. What? Care to learn some pyromancies from this old man? Yeah, I'll learn some oh, pyromancy. Most wise. A chance encounter should not be squandered. To the pleasure Ooh. is mine. <laughs> oh my god, he disappeared. 
Is that some pyromancy bullshit? Do I know pyromancy now? Was that it? Oh, a hand axe. Okay. Uh, which one of these is the hand axe? Oh, here we go. All right. This is le hand axe less good for soup, uh, in my opinion. But I don't know if it's uh, gonna make a huge difference. All right. Oh, he's hanging out at my base place now. Okay, that's cool. Did he just, was he just like hanging up, hanging out up here waiting to, because he clearly wasn't trapped. Is he just waiting to lure somebody? I mean, it, it was effective. I just have follow-up questions. Hey, come over here. Hey, come over here. I won't, I won't fight you, but I want to get the first hit in. Perhaps this is not an option. I'll just fight you again. Yeah! Alright. Oh, I hear some... I hear some big moving around above me. I don't like that. Am I being tracked? Is Superman tracking me? No, I don't think so. Cool spooky atmosphere. Oh, I see a pile of... Yeah, I see a pile of my blood. I see a blood pile. That's mine. Let me go get that. Boop. Puppy. Okay. 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 Let's go. Maybe, maybe we go... Oh, what are you doing over here? Oh, I was not paying attention. You weren't here before. I don't like that. That looks like it's gonna hurt me. Oh! Ma'am! Did you just light yourself on fire? Oh. The intense feeling of being in over one's head. <laughs> That's... That's what I get. Uh, the rule on advice for the stream, I will 100% ask for advice if I need it. Uh, so I wouldn't worry. The, what I'm doing right now is not a serious run. Uh, so <laughs> I'm gonna fuck around and fail a bunch. Uh, and that's just gonna have to be okay. I mean, I guess if it's not, let me know. If this is infuriating, let me know. And that may or may not change how I approach it. See, I was just expecting there to be soup boys over there. And not all these grimdark pilgrims. But it looks like, uh... I, yeah, exactly. Fucking around and failing is... It, you have to think it's fun in this game, because if you don't, then you're not gonna have a good time playing this game. Uh, which is fair. A lot of people don't have fun playing this game. Okay, bye! Oh, I heard a splat. <laughs> Whoa! Pilgrim! How do you... Alright, these dudes haven't aggroed on me yet. That's great. Let's go check out this. Let's go see what's over here. The dogs are one of my least favorite enemies in Dark Souls. Any of the Dark Soul games. They are so fast. The rats are also terrible, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Cause they have poison and that really does a good job of fucking you up. Yeah, from cells dogs OP. They're so fast and they're so jumpy and it's so hard to land a hit on them. Ooh, a cestus. What is a cestus? Is it equipment? Is it a weapon? Are they fists? It looked like a glove, but I don't see it there. Cestus, it's a weapon. It's a fist weapon, okay. All right, it's a fisting weapon. Thank you. <laughs> punch run? Uh, punch drunk run? 
Are these gonna say something like, look out, there's a mouse behind you? Beast ahead? Yeah. Key required ahead, therefore try merchant. It's locked, yeah. Uh, I guess we're gonna, I guess we're just gonna punch something is some sort of beast. Oh. Oh, why, hello, Beard Zach. Oh, were you summoned because I started playing Dark Souls? <laughs> uh, Zach, what happened here is that we finished Unfinished Swan early. Oh! Time to fuck. This fucking rat's gonna fuck me up. Uh, we finished Unfinished Swan early. Oh, I should have healed. I should have healed. That's that's on me. I should have healed. <laughs> we finished we finished on unfinished swan early, and so I entered. I picked a random number generator and scrolled through my epic and steam library until we got to number thirteen, which was Dark Souls three. Uh, the run I'm doing right now is based on our old save file, but also um, I'm equipping anything that I that I pick up when I pick it up as just a fun fun little extra challenge yeah look at all these pilgrims could I if I drop down there is that gonna kill me I don't see why I shouldn't try uh -oh, not great not terrible <laughs> Wow, uh, the punches are not strong, <laughs> and also uh, not not powerful. Not a lot of range. Who could have guessed? Well, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to stick with the punches until I get a better weapon. Uh, so hopefully, one of these. Uh, rats will drop like a knife, maybe. If one of these had like a long sword, that would be cool. Do I get more punches if I do two handed? That's a good question. Let me remember how to. I mean, they're faster. Alright, let's go fist this mouse. Yeah, not really. I don't know if more punches is going to help. <laughs> let me, maybe I'll, let me just switch back. Yeah, spring arms would I think make a big difference for sure. Longer arms, yeah, that would help. Um, maybe there's some sort of uh, atom or injection or power-up we can get. Okay, okay. <laughs> that, I can't believe that worked. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Uh, yeah, uh, Zach, I also don't remember what our build was for this, uh, but actually that worked great, so, you know, you know, weird that this fog bank is only in this one little section. I did bully that giant rat, but, um, that's just, you know, that's just the run we're doing, where we bully. Increase bleed resistance, heck yeah. Ooh, it gave me a little bit of bleed when I put that on. That's so unnerving. All right, uh, I know you guys had some critiques about Punch Run, but feeling really good about Punch Run. Feel like it's really gonna come through for me. Is this just a dead end? Yeah, Rat Puncher. Rat Puncher is a great title. And I uh, look, I got a little shortcut. This is all, this is all coming. This is all coming together. <laughs> Any percent bully run. Uh, I'm gonna punch this suit dude. I'm gonna punch this suit dude to death. Right in the jump. Oh! 
Oh, this dude's harder to bully than Mass. Unexpectedly. Who could have guessed that this guy would be harder to bully than a mouse? Oh, don't go away from me. I don't have much range. Oh. oh god, the bleed is gonna is gonna be what kills me 100 percent I'm just gonna I'm gonna juke a little. Pow, pow! Oh no, no, <laughs> no. What usually happens at moments like this is that I misjudge my distance to a cliffside and roll off a cliff. Ha ha! Ha ha! Yeah! Yes! And see that bleed resistance ring is already paying off for me. Because that for sure would have definitely killed me otherwise. This bridge doesn't go to anywhere, huh? It's more of a decorative bridge. Ooh. See ya. I see an unguarded torch. Yeah, that was a great... What are these messages gonna say? Let the brief hand tell. Huh. Try bonfire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Try bonfire. Uh, which button is good? Yes. Thank you. Oh, is that just gonna... I guess that's just gonna re reload that dude, though, huh? I didn't realize I had already unlocked this bonfire. I'm gonna have to fight Soup Dude again. What have I done? Yeah, oh, that is the bridge to Terabithia. That's a great point. If I jumped off right here, I could go right to Terabithia. Should I do that? I guess I should spend my... I forgot that I have a bunch of souls from that rat I killed. And so that was some of those people that I killed and took their hat off. Uh, let's see. Oh, do I have to go back to the main area to do that in this game? I can't just do it at bonfires? Well, I hope I don't lose all these souls. <laughs> oh well. Uh, let's see. What if I don't want to fight this dude again? That doesn't look like a place I can drop down to. Hey, what's the run button real quick? Does anybody know what the run button is? Uh. Hi dudes. Whoa! before and the giant things I just don't oh this is alarming and upsetting oh my god hold dodge to run okay can I go in here oh god there's a dude in there oh this area is so upsetting oh my god okay 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 are you gonna get are you gonna get fucked up an item <laughs> That rules. Oh, you look scary. Hey, do you want to come outside real quick? Oh god, that didn't kill him outright. I don't like that. There we go. Thank you, my dude. Zeus is up there. <laughs> Metering, metering out some punishment. I can't believe they got Zeus for Dark Souls 3. And that he's helping me with his big spears and stuff. How do I get to that thing, though? Do I have to be on the roof? Oh, I just have to jump, probably. Uh, we uh, sort of, sort of already came through this area. Uh, and once again, does anybody remember the jump button? Uh, I have sort of been through this area, but sort of not. Did that help? Uh, 
run and then dodge. All right. Let me get. Let, let's get this. All right. Parkour. That's just. <laughs> All right. One more. One more go. One more go. I'll get it this time. <laughs> parkour. 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 Pork. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, just one more. I'll, I'll do a better, bigger, uh, bigger, bigger lineup this time. Gotta really get the... <laughs> what? Hardcore parkour! Hardcore! Uh, jumping... See, that's, I think, I think, yeah, I don't think it, it must be. Because that doesn't seem to be the right button. Here's L3. Ah ha ha! Okay, all right, all right, okay, okay. Oh, dope. This is gonna be so much better than a punch, punching glove. <laughs> a, a big old scythe is probably gonna be a better weapon. Although I loved, I loved punch run. Punch run was great. Clearly the most powerful weapon in the game. Just feeling a little bit better about scythe. <laughs> I just think scythe is gonna be a little bit easier. Oh, should I heal? Yeah, I guess I should heal. I like all these flowers, but I'm nervous that there's something evil. Could this be a friendship? Now that's a good message. Uh, huh. This, um, this looks like it might be an arena. <laughs> um, no friends in Dark Souls. What about... Uh, what about that one hollowed lady that was trapped behind a grate and always laughed at all my jokes? I think sh Great curse-ridden tree ahead. Oh, this is the other side of where I was. Okay, I kind of know where I'm at now. Still... It was still making me feel pretty certain that this is a boss. This seems just feel it just this just feels like it's a boss run. Bloodborne, I had lots of friends. Bloodborne, I had that one melty dude in that shrine. Yeah, and Onion Knight. I don't think I've met Onion Man in this game yet, but Onion Knight clearly a friend. Oh, is this just a cool, pretty open area? in which there's not going to be a horrifying monster that appears and fucks my shit up. It just feels like... Just... It just... It's just that it seems like this tree looks like wicked curse. Come on. Go over Don't you start, okay? <laughs> the range on this weapon is a little bit confusing. Because it seems like if they're really close, I should maybe not be able to attack them. Hey! Um, um, I see tree lakes too in H. London. Uh, now that you point it out, it does really look like this tree has legs, huh? I can't shake the feeling that this tree has legs. Um, do I have... No, I guess I don't have... Um, I was hoping I had my... Uh, 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 binoculars uh, equipped, but I don't seem to. like you're really slow. 
you do have a lot of friends. That makes me nervous. Oh yeah, see, he's gonna take care of me. Uh, uh, that didn't seem to do any damage. Uh, maybe I have to attack the limbs. didn't seem to do anything either. Gang! I'm getting nervous. Am I supposed to attack the egg sack? Don't stand up. Oh shit, is stuff falling from you? Oh boy. Well, I wish this weren't what I had to do, but it does seem like it is, huh? really cursed. A lot of stuff in this game is cursed, but this one is really cursed. Oh. More cursed than normal. Oof. Yeah, it is earning the title for sure. Oh, that's a big hit. I'm just not doing a lot of damage. It feels like maybe Scythe is the wrong weapon for something like this. Uh. Hey, Zach, does this count as a gang fight? <laughs> right up to that jump. conclude that fight with um oh boy uh <laughs> well okay I guess that's what we're doing I guess that's the part of the game that we're at oh it's kind of a puzzle boss is the puzzle is the answer to the puzzle just that I've got to um, squash those eggs? <laughs> the fact that they're in the crotch is also just such a choice. You know what, this feels, now that I'm here, I'm like, this does not feel like it's the closest bonfire. In fact, I know it to not be the closest bonfire, so what am I even doing here? It. I want this thing. Worker trousers? Is that what I'm already wearing? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna, I think, travel to a different... I think there's... I think there's... I think one of the other bonfires I was using was closer. The puzzle is to bust the balls. Okay, great. 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 Night leggings. No thank you. Let's put on some of these worker trousers. Yeah! Alright, my look's coming together. Alright, let's... I think Cliff Underside was closer. I like that these pants come with a loincloth. I'll enjoy the second phase of the boss. All right, let's see if we can't get there. I don't, I don't know if the scythe is gonna, not to make a pun, I don't know if the scythe is gonna cut it. <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to get to the second phase of this boss using this scythe. Let me see if I, I think I've got some, I should have some fire bombs, yeah. 
Uh, I want to do... I, I, I always worry about using up items that are good for attacking specific bosses before I'm good at fighting the boss, you know what I mean? Looks like there's somebody in there. Did it not seem like somebody went in here? No? Okay. Ugh. Okay. All right, okay, let's do it. Let's just do it. I get it now. I understand what I have to do. I regret it, but I understand. Are you just not automatically awakened? This feels unusual for, like I have to re-awaken this boss before it's gonna fight me? Hey, give me your dick. Hey, let me see your junk. I'm gonna donk on it. doing very much damage at all to this creature. Okay. That's a long kick. Just to figure out. Ow! Hey, I'm not fighting you, okay, dude? What? No! Oh, boy. That's a lot of movement, huh? And I'm just supposed to keep track of where this jump clips into in the world? Expected that goo does bad stuff to me. Okay, well that's fair. I would not want me getting close to my dog to the side either if I were to do one more. The scythe has a weird hitbox, by the way. You do little damage right up close, but a lot more. Okay, at significant distance. Okay, okay. Alright, let's do one more go on this. I normally stop uh, streaming around 2 o'clock, which is it, what it is. But I want to do I want to do one more run. You pop the junk and it gets grumpy. Well, that's understandable. I can't find myself faulting the tree for that stance. I do appreciate, I guess it's early in the game, but I do appreciate how relatively chill this run back is. After your run, can I tell you a spoiler about this boss? Yes. In fact, if it's a spoiler on how to cheese this boss, then you can tell me right now. <laughs> if there's a recommendation other than firebombs, which I'm just not emotionally ready to use yet. Not cheese strats? Okay. I just love cheese so much. Just fire and pop the balls. Stop it! Oh, fuck me. I was not paying attention. God damn it, Dark Souls. Shit. Okay, one more go. Just one more go for real, though, this time. Just one more go. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Uh, just one more go. One more go. That's a that's a mulligan. That we're carry mulliganing that, and it's gonna be fine. We're gonna we're just gonna mulligatani that one and ch do it again. I can't quit whenever Zach. <laughs> At some point, I'm gonna have to eat lunch, and then I'll I'll stop. Uh, look at my look at my soul so tantalizingly close. Oh good, I got all my souls back, guys. Check it out, I got them all back. Okay, my quarrel is not with you. Not this again. Hey, could you clear out some of your followers so I can get up on your dick? Okay, could you get more of them, though? for the Bofa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was such a big swing. for a long time to catch your breath. Wow, well when you just put it up in my face like that, I don't know what you expect me to do. Die. I guess you expect me to die. <sighs> spoiler time? Yeah, I would love a spoiler for this this boyo. Give me what you got. This is an optional boss! Oh, well, fuck that. <laughs> Goodbye. That is the last time I'm fighting that dude. No, I might go back and fight him. For real, though. Okay, so that's- I guess I'm supposed to go over the bridge. Let's do a quick run over the bridge, and let's just see... The ability to make boss weapons, and for no other reason. Well, I'm probably not gonna make boss re boss weapons, because I don't know what that is. Alright, let's aggro this dude. 
kill him. Oh no, I didn't mean to aggro you. Not you, sir! Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Oh, well, that was predictable. I did a bad job and it killed me. That's about how this game is supposed to go. Zack, I can quit whenever. I just want to cross this bridge and see what's on this other side of the bridge. <laughs> and then I will definitely stop for real, though. Just, I just want to run across, I just want to run across that bridge. And see what's on the other side of the bridge. Just one more bridge, just one more bridge. And then I'll go to sleep for real, though. Okay, I'll let these boys clear out. I'm just not gonna fuck with the suit boys. That's my decision. Oh, this dog got stuck again. This one dog sometimes gets stuck on the geometry and doesn't get to continue. I'm just gonna juke past the suit boys. Because I wasn't over the bridge. I didn't get over the bridge. <laughs> yeah, Mercury. That is the thing about this game is that you can just die in the game. And then that's just it. <laughs> this game does not reward trying. It re rewards succeeding only. Oh my god, now this other dude's caught on the... Okay. Stop getting caught on this bridge. Get out of here. You're gonna fuck up my run if you're still there. Oh good, none of them none of them heard that. See, easy. Okay. Alright, just running. Not engaging with soup boys. Oh my god, it's so legitimately alarming to see those things fly past. This might be a dead end, huh? <laughs> oh, hi. You look like you're gonna talk to me or fuck me up. God, I miss having a big stagger weapon. That's been, I think, my number one issue is that I've played Dark Souls 1 with a big ass, or, and Bloodborne, with big ass stagger weapons. And so, if I got a cool big hit on a dude, they just kind of have to deal with it. Okay. Now I can conclude my conversation without a, a rude little busy buzzy in, buddy interrupting. Like your mm. hammer. Another one of those unkindled, are you? Yeah. All you faceless undead, behaving as if you deserve respect. Ah! Mm, no matter. Heed my words. Yeah, I'm heeding. You, here, in this land of hollows. You're like a frail maiden on the front lines. I mean, that is essentially literally what I am. If they go on ahead, traipse right past the abandoned church. You'll face death. Mm. And it won't be pretty. Mm. Enough death to leave you broken. Time after time. <laughs> Is this dude just describing <laughs> the Dark Souls series? Yeah. <laughs> I really liked his... <laughs> yeah. Oh, man ahead. Thank you. Very useful. <laughs> yeah, the... <laughs> yeah. Good. That's good writing. Does not open from this side. I'm hearing some pretty upsetting sounds. I like it better when they laugh forever. Because then I feel like I'm in on the joke. 
His ha 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 yeah was just so dismissive. the best reveal in this game mm. possible mm. oh <laughs> pardon me i was absorbed in thought <laughs> take your time dude i am Siegbert of katarina ah. to be honest i'm in a bit of a pickle you're in a bit of an onion have you ever walked near a white birch only to be struck by a great arrow well if i'm not mistaken they come from this tower Ooh. Whoever it is, I'm sure I can talk some sense into them. What? They're doing a great job. But I have to find a way up. And that's just the trouble. This lift only goes down, you see, and... Uh, <laughs> I don't think that's... I know what well, you're saying. that doesn't get me anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. This lift only goes down. But you know... With a little warming up, eventually... No. No. Are you considering climbing? Is that what you're I've saying? I've got to use my head and you Gotta think. use your onion. Hmm. Hmm. This lift oh, with a... Hmm. Okay. Well, let's go down. hearing what sounds like static. Try luring it out and then try the lift. Oh boy. Luring, luring what out message. Ah! Scusi? Ooh! Ooh! Oh boy, I do wish I hadn't sent that lift back up though. Ow! Uh, My guess is that you can probably... Did I de-aggro you? Yeah, this is a fucking bloodborne ass enemy for sure. No, come back over here. I want to drop on you. Oh, whoops! Frostbitten! Oh boy. All right. What a lanky fellow. What an uncomfortable lanky fellow. <laughs> Oof, a doofa. Okay, but that it didn't look like that drop attack did a decent amount of damage. So that didn't look too terrible. But now I am really going to stop for real. For real, for real. Um, but that's a, anyway, that's Dark Souls 3. Outrider Knight. Okay. Uh so that's Dark Souls 3. It's a good game. I keep meaning to go back to and play more of. So I'll do that. Uh, but that's the stream for today. Uh, so thanks everybody for coming and hanging out. I hope you have a good rest of your weekend. Good rest of your Sunday. I'll see you guys uh, Wednesday, 8 p.m. Eastern time for a uh, Blender stream. Come on, come on. I didn't say you could stop waving. You stop waving when I tell you to. Okay. Bye, everybody. Have a good weekend.